This video is brought to you by Into the AM. It's raining right now, and as lifelong dedicated swap meet hunters, the swap meets are closed today, so Ricky and I are gonna do the age-old test. Can you still find good deals at thrift stores? Only one way to find out. We just walked in. What'd you grab over here? A, a random customer I'm filming. <laughs> Cruising USA, Mission Impossible. Oh, and oh, Cruising, oh, Cruising World Rose also. Again. They got Lord of the Rings. Ricky, what else they got here? Final Fantasy, the best one. Some Pokemon cards down here as well. I thought I saw a Robocop logo, but I am completely wrong on that. There's no Robocop logo. Oh, we got a couple consoles down here though. There's a PlayStation right here, and then there's also a PlayStation 1. Uh, from what I'm seeing, the prices do not look like anything I need. Well, we walked in, and as we walked in, a guy was at the front saying that someone just bought out a bunch of stuff. I was like, gosh dang it, Ricky. We Dude, were like one minute too late. He was a minute too late too, though. Yeah, so man, maybe we should have started at nine. Ah, dang it. We should have started at nine, and go figure. Any good VHS? They have Flintstones Christmas? Oh, I do love the Flintstones Christmas. I have the hard shell of this, but actually, this will be cool. I'll pick this one up, Ricky. Get also, Home Alone, Home Alone 2. Two. Man, oh, if you ever find the uh, the bonus behind the disc scenes, man, yeah. I got that last time sealed. It, it was a very pricey VHS. I mean, I paid a quarter for it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. It, uh, it did very well. What do I need, Ricky? I need Crocodile Dundee. <laughs> <laughs> looking for some Xbox games because I recently got an Xbox kiosk, so I want to have cool stuff playing in the background of the game room. I thought two funny things to have in the background playing. Right now I have Doom 3 playing, would be SpongeBob and Shrek 2. Not gonna lie, I have to be 100% honest, besides Shrek being life, SpongeBob was something we had playing in the background all the time when I would skate at my friend's half pipe and her and her little brothers, shout out to Jake and Luke, we'd play, uh, we'd skateboard all the time. And in the background the whole time we could just hear uh, Gary and Mr. Krabs and SpongeBob and Sandy Squirrel and the whole crew. Do it, Ricky. I can't do it right now. I Into the cart we go. A little trifecta of fun. Just started following her while she's taking this out. Is that for sale? I think it can help you. Oh, sweet. Thank you. She was walking out with it, and I was like, ooh, I'm curious. I'm interested in seeing that. <laughs> oh, no, the one on the bottom, the console, actually. What's what's it looking at for price? Okay. Um, yes. I'll put it in my cart. I'm in. Check out this stuff by Into the AM. I've been seeing a lot of my YouTube friends talk about this company, Into the AM, and as a game hunter who walks around and doesn't sit down and play games all day, it's time to see if I can put these things to the test. I should have filmed that differently because I'm gonna be honest, I'm already wearing one of the sweatshirts, and when I put it on, I promise on my life, I immediately looked over at my wife and I was like, dang, this is, it, it's nice, and it's comfortable, and it looks good. As a game hunter, let's just pretend right now. Oh, box of Nintendo games. Ricky, grab it. Total movement and control. I gotta try on a shirt now. Ooh. It's a me, Mario. And for those of you that are into graphic tees, they have a lot of graphic tees as well. It almost looks like I have muscles. There's a lot of cool designs, like this design. This one reminds me of like a tattoo parlor. I really like this. If you wanna check out any of this awesome clothing by Into the AM, the best way to do so is using bundle deals, just like game hunting. Use my discount link, which will be in the description below, and you'll get an additional 10% off. Oh, and some of those bundle deals are three graphic tees for just $60, or three basic tees for just $49.95. Thank you so much, Into the AM, for the amazing clothes and for sponsoring this channel. Guys, that was fun. Ricky, all of a sudden, it's funny because Ricky and I were like, we're going to stick together, which we were planning. But so I saw the lady walk out from the back room and I didn't see the GameCube. It's all controller dangling. Yeah. And I was like, was that a GameCube controller? So I start following her over there. And when I get over there, I still don't know what it was. I'm like, oh, can I see that? Whatever it is. I think it's a video game. Yeah. And she pulls it out. It's a GameCube with Metroid Prime inside. 40 bucks isn't bad. I know there might be more stuff. Actually, sometimes you can peek over there and kind of see what they're gonna bring out. I did that before like two weeks ago and I had them bring out Smash Bros. No way. Yeah, so. But while we're here, I mean, are, are the, is this one valuable? Is this one worth anything? I don't, I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I used to love Guitar Hero and I, I do collect, but this isn't anything I'm dying to actually play again. Oh, I almost wanna test to see if there's a How disc much? in there. 50 bucks. You know what we should do though? Take it and let's go plug it in in the back and see if there's a game. Check it out. We're looking right here. And if you zoom in real tight, it could be Mario, Wii, Xbox, and a few others. She's getting, hey, you were doing the same thing we were. <laughs> you were doing the same thing we were. Yeah. What? what? Oh my Isn't this God. the one? This one, so I, I know for certain this is like $150. No way. For certain. 
like for certain for certain. I, I know because I edited a video recently where someone bought this and that was a resale on it. I mean, it has some writing on it and stuff. It's not sealed, but oh my gosh. <laughs> What's going on today? What? We haven't been. <laughs> okay, you know, hey, maybe we need to start coming here directly after the swap meet. Dude, that's, this, that's true. This, Forget breakfast. This has been awesome. Oh, she's holding my GameCube, by the way. It's up there. They held it for me. So, my goodness, I got stuff to collect, stuff to flip, and even stuff we can test for fun. What a freaking start. Dude, this is great. This is oh, I'm, I'm, I haven't been so excited in a while. We can do a little dance, baby. You're looking, there it is, Ricky. You can see that, you can grab that, Ricky. It might go good with my kiosk. Are you talking about this? I see that, yes, but okay, yes as well. Oh, and there's more right there. But I saw an Xbox logo from a mile away. Look oh. at that. That'll go great with my kiosk, Is Ricky. that for the original or 360? Oh, I think this is 360. But you know, it's still, it's still a cool piece. I'm definitely gonna pick it up. Xbox controller, man, you know what? I'm not gonna lie. I collected Xbox a long time ago and then I stopped collecting Xbox but now that I got the kiosk, man, I mean, I've been collecting some Xbox One stuff because I got that kiosk a while ago, but now the OG Xbox, this has been, oh my gosh, dude, I'm, I'm coming to Savers every day of my life again. So yeah, look at Wiimote, Wiimote, uh, candy controller, Wiimote. I mean, if these were Motion Plus, I'd probably grab them. I don't like to collect like Wii stuff to flip on, I like collect, I only like to collect Wii stuff to, to kind of keep a lot of the Wii stuff. It did really good for a while in the flipping world, then did really bad. So what I buy for the Wii, I, plan, I usually plan on keeping. So this is a great test. Ricky grabbed a Wii that's definitely too expensive. But what if there's a game inside? Oh my gosh, please, 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 please. This is something. the moment. This is the moment of truth. This is the moment. Jared put like a really rare Wii game coming out. <laughs> Yay! And that hurts. Some would say it even stings. Oh! <laughs> It's official JP, how much? There's no price on it. How much is that one? $7.99? I mean, it's not a good deal. I didn't get to that. We'll just throw them in the cart. Yeah. Pick them up. Ricky just saw uh, Pichu over here. Here you go, Ricky. You caught Trying to get the cart, hold on. It looks like, oh wow, we're playing. Watch out, let her go by, Ricky. Let, let, let her go by. Oh, go ahead, sorry. How much money if I make it in? Random guy in the cool pants. Seven dollars if I make it in. Okay. Um, how, wait, how light is this thing? Okay. Ew. Oh gosh, it's so light, Ricky. It's not gonna go that far. Gah! Yes! No! Oh! <laughs> I was just looking to get this. Uh, by the way, we apologize for being so like in their way. I felt bad, we were like all up in their space. Um, I was gonna buy this, but then gloriousness arose from the heavens, from the sky. The most beautiful Patrick I've ever seen. Definitely. Here you go, Ricky. Ricky just bought this. No, it's yours. Catch. Ricky's buying that ratatouille right there. He actually sells for like 25 bucks. So are you keeping this one or are you selling? I actually have ratatouille stuff, but I know maybe let your kids have like a good month with it first and good. then sell it. You know, that's, that's see good. if they actually care about it or not. That's good. But otherwise, man, we are stacked in here and there she's loading up our, our GameCube up front. What a glorious thing. Out of the way wagon, we got ourselves a full cart. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. Literally thought this was an N64 logo from far away and I almost crapped myself. Hey, cool. Dude, what? from here, I Shut look up. over yeah. and I'm like, is that the Wii logo? Look at a Wii bowling tournament. <laughs> I just bought that. Look on the back. What the heck? Let me see that. <laughs> that is the weirdest thing. A Wii bowling tournament shirt? I don't know how I feel about this. Like, would anybody want to wear this? The at funny this thing point? is, if you only look at the front, you would have never found. Like, <laughs> dude, <laughs> what? So cool! What the heck, dude? Is this from the game? I mean, there is an NES game named Totally Rad, but I don't think that's vintage. And it looks vintage. just like the game cover, though. Like, you know, b b besides the monster. Interesting. I mean, if it's if it's vintage, you have a chance. If it's not, then it's just someone who wanted something that says Totally Rad. I can't tell because Port and Company's. Old it, school, it but they also make new stuff. Mm, pick it up! <laughs> yes, I made it! <laughs> what? Dude, found a Mario shirt. A Mario shirt? <laughs> Here we go! You're an idiot. Dang, 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 dang. They just brought this out and it's really cool. It's 75 bucks, but it's a Treehouse of Horror Simpsons 34th premiere party like display. I, I really, we couldn't find anything on it. We kind of looked it up a little bit. Man, it would be really cool display. I don't know if I have like a good spot for that, so to say. 
I feel horrible passing up on something like this because it's like my jam, but I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I mean, I guess the display is just worth what you're willing to pay. So I don't know. I guess I just wish I knew a little more, a little more on it. Dang. Hi, so that Simpsons thing, we looked it up, Ricky and I, and it looks like it was given to like guests maybe at the premiere party. So that's as far as we got with it. We couldn't see anything else. This close. Guarantee you we're both gonna regret it. We're gonna regret it. We'll see. Editor Jared's probably going crazy right now. He's like, oh, I love the Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that for me, 50 bucks. Oh boy, and some other stuff over here, but yeah. Oh boy. The oh. rain, the rain is strong right now. Um, I'm gonna put the camera away because I don't want to run through the rain with the camera. Dude, these bags won't so. survive that. I know. Where's your car at? Where's your car? Uh, oh, it's over there. It's over there. there. Let me get the keys All right, out. off to the next spot, guys. We're going to another spot that we haven't been to in a while. Surprise, surprise, where will it be? Okay, first we're eating, and there was some like Mario Brothers thing on in the background for the store. Look at that, that's the, mas that? that's the store mascot. His name's Templeton. Look at that. That's kind of fun. Oh, poor guy. We're getting Mexican food, baby. Oh, there it is. That's a place called Tio Flacos. Free shout out to the Tio Flacos. Off to another thrift store right here. We're waiting to go to another store after this, but while we're waiting for them to open, Eco Town it is. Thrift, 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 Part two, part three as well. You know, I, this one didn't do it for me. <laughs> I thought it was all right. It was okay. The brand new one was pretty garbage too. That like the garbage. brand new one. I don't think I finished it because well, they would just. They made you not like the kid. It's the. Like dude, I didn't. I, I, I hated that kid. <laughs> yeah, I stole that doll. He was a good actor, but I didn't like the kid. <laughs> these are cool to see. The old Shack attacks right here, and these are vintage. Wow, oh look, it has uh, both different schemes of his outfit. That's really cool. I actually, look at that branding on Attack. It's such a cool logo font. I love it. Got some cool pops here. I like this uh, stand right here, digital stand from South Park. Also like all these Ghostbusters one. All these cool designs from the Stay Puft. This one's really cool. I like the mini puff just li lifting and yoking out. But the other ones are some cool ones over here. Ricky, grab them. Which one did you grab, Ricky? I think you're buying one. Ricky's buying Vision. Vision. Like $40 one, but oh, nice. 15 bucks in that. Coolio. I actually saw that show, WandaVision or whatever it was called. It was good. It was slow. It's funny. First. Most people hated the at first. That was my favorite part of the whole series. As soon as it got more marvel I was like, eh, I like the original stuff. I'm not a big Marvel guy. Ooh, I do like Seal. Nicolas Cage, though. I was like, dude. Ooh, la la. Ricky just found a Final Fantasy VIII toy sitting right here. Zell. And then they got Reboot as well. And then this is really cool to me too, Mission Impossible. Oh, this is ticking me. This is oh, oh so the, but actually that's very that's cool as well. Cool. I like that as well. But yeah, they have a whole bunch of toys lying around as well. Oh, you know what? Flipping a Tarzan toy? That reminds me so much of the Batman, Gold Batman. That's really cool. I really cool. like those. Oh, a Hercules toy down here as well. They got some good, a Men in Black toy down here also. They got a good little selection of that. And they got video games too and vintage clothes as well. And more like anime stuff. I see Street Fighter down there. I mean, look at all this. What a store they got. They got the whole thing popping in here. We'll be poking around for a while. Time to put this camera away. What you get? This giant thick Tracy right here. Look at the size of this. I think I have to buy this, Ricky. Like I have to buy this. This is America's greatest detective. My gosh, man. Old Dick Tracy branding. It's just so cool. It's the ultimate like, yeah, hey. Oh my gosh, all the little gadgets. You know, he's like Inspector Gadget mixed with Mission Impossible, mixed with like an old gangster movie. So cool, I have to buy it. Look how big it is, look how big it is. All right, so we're in their game section and we're just kind of browsing around. And as you can see, they got a whole bunch of stuff, different consoles, PS2, Xbox, Xbox 360, consoles, Super Nintendo. Ooh, some good Super Nintendo games actually over there. But what Ricky and I noticed right away is there's a God of War PS4 down here, but it comes with three controllers and these controllers alone are like a hundred dollar controllers and they're in really good condition so that's like 200 dollars right there and that console the ps4 pro console i don't even know what that goes for but there's guaranteed you this is a great deal i mean look at this 250 just for a regular one but come on look at this contra 3 donkey kong there's a, a regular contra up here there's a contra and even back here we're looking at like battle toads and a bunch of other good games. We're gonna have to pull this out because there's a lot of good stuff. Look at that Coleco Vision right down there. Oh my gosh, my footage sucks right now. I'm so sorry, you guys. 
Now that's better. Oh my gosh, guys, so the, the video game stuff didn't work out, but my goodness, Mars Attacks on card, original Lost World on card, original Jurassic Park on card, Mighty Ducks, Gargoyles. Oh my gosh, what a little selection. Oh my gosh, Godzilla Wars. Oh my goodness, what a selection. Wait, what's this, what's this? Look at this, oh, they got the duck cycle in the box, Ricky, pull that out. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude. Holy cow. All right, here's what I grabbed. Ugh. I got a giant The Goonies Never Say Die shirt. I got a Universal Halloween Horror Nights Walking Dead. I got an Attack of the Show Vintage G4, the old G4 t-shirt. Actually, these are pretty pricey. And then I got a great Horrorland Goosebumps. Super cool. And now it's time to go back to the last store. Let's go check it out. It's gonna be a good one, I promise. And here it is. Let's go, baby. It's crazy, no matter how many times you see it, when you actually like look at it in person, it looks just so beefy. My goodness. It's Beautiful. glorious. It's glorious. Here we are at Cape and Cowell Collectibles. I have not been here in like two years. They haven't been open in like two years, so. We're back in the store. Let's dig. Oh, boy. Look at that. Legs. Oh, oh, boy. Bass. So you got to put together these things completely. You just don't see them all. Together. Trying to get a set put together. Yeah. Yeah, my goodness. That is beautiful, Ricky. That's really cool. A lot of Mega Man figures in there. That's a good one. That's a good one, Ricky. <laughs> So Chuck Norris, you know, I have the most epic thing though ever about Chuck Norris. You know how I, when people say like, my dad could beat up your dad, mm -hmm. I have the yeah. ultimate. My dad was literally Chuck Norris's security and bodyguard oh, for really? a while. Yeah, <laughs> so, <laughs> so. The so, mini boss. You Chuck know, Norris. that is so cool. I love it, oh my gosh. Well, I bet my dad can beat up your dad. Oh yeah, that is just too great. With this camo suit. Look at this, Ricky. Oh, dude, you need that. Dude, you need this. You know I need that, bro. I'm 100% gonna take him. Look at that. Battle Troll with Chuck Norris. That's, you know, <laughs> that's the lineup of people you don't want to mess with right there. <laughs> I'm feeling good already. Wow. A little wear and tear on it, but... I mean, this, I've seen them look much worse than this. What do these, like, go for? Uh, loose. Probably, like, 150 to 250 nowadays. Okay. Boxed. It all depends on the box condition. Yeah, I mean, the box has good color to it. It's a little mangled, though, but these things didn't hold up. Wow. A few hundred bucks, but normally I'll keep this, try and get a better body for it. With the yeah. stickers intact. Jeez. I make recros all the stickers on stuff nowadays. Okay, let's see. Yeah, everyone stand back. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. <laughs> wow, got the Atona right here. Woo. Just looking beautiful from Zelda. Oh man, you got any more oddball stuff lying around anywhere? Everywhere. You know, like place. the weird, random lines that nobody cares about, like Chuck Norris and Battle Troll. Still digging. I can trust this. Vinny from Biker Mice from Mars. Freaking love Biker Mice from Mars. Not just the show, but, but the video game as well. And then Ricky having to pull a review from Ninja Gaiden, right? Yep. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, okay, what else? Oh yeah, and the opponent. Yeah. A million times have I looked at these and not bought them. I'm curious if people can give me a bold deal. We got Slash, Foot Soldier, Leatherhead, so much. I mean, they all remind me of the video game, but then you also have Shredder. He's got 30 a piece on him. I wonder if you do like 100 ball, 30, 60, 90. Yeah, that's like 20 bucks off or something. <sighs> Should I ask him? Yeah, I don't want to put the camera on him. I'll, I'll ask him off camera. I don't want, I don't want to feel pressured, even though I kind of do. All right, all right. He said he'll do a deal if I grab them all. I don't know what the deal is yet, but I'm going to grab all of them. I'm actually really excited. So I didn't even know these were a thing. They were saying apparently these came out like three or four years ago. And they are, as Ricky breaks the store. It wasn't me. <laughs> yeah, as we watched you do it, that's okay. <laughs> but I didn't know they did these, man. That is really cool looking, dude. I just heard Ricky oh, verbally, that one right verbally gasp out loud. So I had to come over and see what it was about. What is it, Ricky? I heard you gasp. You'll see it right now when my hand's reaching in. Oh, Cowboys and Mesa. <laughs> oh yeah, I love I was like, Cowboys. What the? Another oddball piece. Yeah, we were talking with Sterling, who by the way runs this wonderful shop. You may have seen if you watched back in the day, but uh, we love the oddball stuff. That's just, it's the best stuff. I know the big lines are important too to everybody, but we love the weird, the random. Oh 
Oh my gosh. I know you see these everywhere. Or I started to see these recently in more and more videos and collections, but I gotta pick these up. Leonardo First Degree Ninja and Michelangelo right here. And also... You wanna see the one I found? What, what'd you find? What's that from? No way. Oh, and I picked that up a second ago. I was like, I don't know what this is from. <laughs> Dang it, Ricky, you <laughs> son of a gun. Well, hey, I got this. Actually, this is really cool. All yours, bro. You sure? Oh, turtle power. <laughs> Into the stack. All right, here's everything I am gonna get. I haven't got a price yet. I'm not gonna put pressure on them to give me a price on camera, but I'm getting all the turtles, Foot Clan, Shredder, Slash, Leatherhead, uh, Shredder, a Vinny, I always forget his name, Chuck Norris, a Battle Trolls, and a Michelangelo, and Leonardo, and Ricky Sticky, what are you getting? Uh, I'm getting Ryu and Bucky. Well, we are out of here and we loaded up today game cubes and toys and goodies and Ricky, it's back. Say the magic words. We're back for my son, you idiot. <laughs> Ricky, say it. For my son. For my son.